On today's episode of Mummy's Boy, we find out which is my least favourite tattoo. What a fuck boy is. And why I threw up 12 times in a field. Remember to give this video a like and subscribe so you never miss an episode. It's Mummy's Boy. Hello and welcome to Mummy's Boy with me, Arthur Hill, and my adorable and flamboyant mother. Flamboyant? Lisa, say hello, mum. Hello. Deep down, I've always been a mummy's boy at heart, and in this weekly podcast, I get to spend some quality time with mum and receive some much needed advice. Needed? Mm, needed. Receive some much needed, needed, needed advice that only a mother can give. But sometimes my mum needs help too. Mm. TikTok, social media, viral videos, celebrities. These are all things which my poor mum just can't get her grey hair around. Hey. So I'm here to help her before this modern world leaves her behind. Mm. Not only will I help her unravel the mysteries of youth and bring her into the digital age, but I'll also be making Lisa's motherly wisdom available to all of you as well. So, if you're in need of advice, or <laughs> even just have a question or story that you're desperate for Arthur's mum to read, slide into our DMs on socials at Mummy's Boy Pod, or send us a message, or even a voice note voice to WhatsApp on 07822 013 Three, seven. And no matter what <laughs> the issue, I will ask her in a feature I like to call Mum. Can we talk? Oh, I think we need to. Um, welcome back oh. to the pod. Yes, hello. Mummy's bloody boy. That's not very nice. Mummy's fucking boy. Hey. What's your Back mouth? in business for another week. Another week of on joy and Earth. laughter. Being the bloody bastions. Oh, not the I'm bastions not again. Come one. on, don't Sorry. bring up Sorry. bastions. Sebastian. Sebastian. How have you been? How have you been, Mum? How are you doing? What's the matter with you? You're okay? acting like a weirdo. Is everything okay? Stop it. Oh, actually, you're a bit, that's a bit creepy. Oh, oh that's really creepy. Us. No, I don't want to tell, tell you anything. What's been going on? What's wrong with your head? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Um, uh, everything's fine, I think. Uh, everything's fine. Everything Just moves fine. along day by day, mm. same old, same old. Day butter in, the toast. Butter the toast. I can't, I'm so bad oh, at my not another quotes. bloody quote. <laughs> Peep show. Butter the toast. Oh, it's dear God. Um, well, that did sound very David Mitchell. Mm, I presume butter, that was. Yeah. Butter the toast. Butter the toast. How's your? How are you? Your I'm life good. is more exciting than mine. I'm Come on, good, tell Mum. me about your life. I'm good. Things are happening. Well, are they? Yes. Come on, then. Outside what? of the world of this podcast. Outside the world um, of this room. Uh, yeah, I'm doing. I'm doing Reading and Leeds. Oh, now R and L festival. R and L. I've been booked. I'm booked and busy. Booked and. I'm officially on the circuit, as they say. Really? Is that what it's yeah. called? Is I, it? Yeah, I think so. That's very exciting. Festival circuit. That's very exciting. I don't know anything about anything to do well, with I went festivals. There as, I went there as a young 16-year-old. With first festival, lovely Jamie. With Jamie and Harvey and Harry Aww. and all my friends. Um, first time I got absolutely leathered. Oh dear, really? Woke up in the medical tent. I wonder if you know about <gasps> this. Probably haven't told you this. No, I yeah, didn't know about bad. that. You woke up in the medical tent. Well, we obviously couldn't buy alcohol, so we got alcohol from Harvey's brother. Um, right. Scott Kirchkaiser, Scott, police, if you're listening, wish if I'd known that, that man. wouldn't have let you live um, with Scott yeah, Kirchkaiser. No, he gave us some kind of liquor Did in he? a Schweppes bottle. Did he? Already a dodgy start. And I remember Naughty just boy. it was the night before the music had even started, so it just had nothing to do except drink, drink in a field. And I just have a sip of the Schweppes bottle, and then I think it was Southern Comfort. I think is what it was. Mm. Um, and then Gross. have water afterwards. I just do that. And I didn't know how much I should have until I passed out. And then he realized you'd had too much. On a tent. Oh. And then woke up in the medical tent. And they were like, we're going to move you closer to the heat. And I went, don't move me. I'll be sick. Oh, God. Pick me up. Like, and I was sick. <laughs> I said, I told you so. <laughs> And Such then, a good patient. Yep. And then um, oh dear. spent the night there. My girlfriend at the time was very nice, by my side the whole time. Was she? Um, and then we went back to her tent. I slept at her tent. 
then made my way in the morning feeling surprisingly fresh. I was like, I feel okay. Really? Yeah. So a couple hours passed and I went to get a burger. Oh, God. Um, and I took one bite of the <laughs> burger. <laughs> yeah, okay. And I threw up. Lovely. Everywhere. Lovely, lovely. And I kept throwing up. Okay. All day. Thank you. There was a point in our camp that was <sighs> called Shrek Swamp. Oh, can Because we, like, it was the bit where I threw up maybe a dozen times. Oh. Um, but I think it's, I think I'm very glad it happened to me because it taught me very young <laughs> of how much I can drink. And I've thrown up very little since. Well, apart from those dreadful things you showed me when you were in wherever you were, Ibiza or something with the lads and that disgusting. Oh, yeah. Well, that might have been the that, that might have made. honestly been the. The gap, genuinely, might have okay. been Okay, well, let's long. hope so, Arthur. Um, yeah. Oh, God. Well, yeah, I don't even think about that, how the whole of Reading probably heard my... Yeah, my okay, but can we not... Let's not. <laughs> no! No! Echoing. No. Pigeons flying. Stop! That's no orc horn. <laughs> um, but yeah, that was my Reading experience. And then the next year, um, I wasn't... I wasn't a good boy. Oh. That's all we'll say. Awesome. Yeah. I've never been to a music festival. Never. Never. Despite spending your life in music. Yeah. Career well, in not, music. You've not never, that sort of music, You've never is been it? able to no. let loose. Festivals are no. crazy. They well, no, don't like, appeal to me. You, let's put all these people in this thing with music and just basically everything's semi-legal for five days. Sounds and horrible. it's sort of like a... It's, it's, it is, it's great. It's great fun when, if, if you do it right. Yeah, but doesn't, well, do, but have you done it right? Yeah, doesn't no, sound best like of you all, have, really. Best of all, the last, the last festival I camped at was best of all before right. it stopped. And that was lovely. Okay. The weather was amazing. Um, yeah, I imagine that would yeah, be quite Yeah, the acid pleasant. was great. Oh, stop um, it, Arthur. The meth was He's on the final funny. night. Stop um, laughing at him. Yeah, it was a really fun. They, they're great. I'll I mean, they, they, you feel real sort of, you know, sense of this is what life's about. You know, listening to music with your friends in the sun. Yes. No responsibilities except, you know, eating. Yes. Drinking. I, yeah, I get that. But then, and then you've got to sleep in a tent, which I also don't do. Mm. Yeah, I'm not looking. For, I think. Yeah, I'm. I'm a bit worried about. I think I'm doing Glastonbury this year. I'm not Stop performing. It. Oh, I see. Right. Hopefully, we'll see. I mean, now I'm on the circuit. Yeah. Um, you see a lot of this shruggy thing today. Am I? Yeah. Michael McIntyre. Oh, is that him? Oh. It is, yes. Okay. Yes. Reading Festival. Oh, is that what he does? I haven't done this what in a are while. You doing? It's a bit rusty. We're going to get Lisa in now. <laughs> yeah. We are, we are. He used to talk about Five Spice, didn't he? Yeah, you loved that, that him? bit. I, I, you loved that. I did. He did yeah. a good, you, you used to do five a good spice. Michael. That's what he did. He did five and five. It was and like this whole spies. bit about like yeah, about being imagine five being spies. five spice in the cupboard, which I think yes. is a bit shit. Well, now you liked it at the up, time. I know, but I was fourteen. Laugh. Okay, well, I liked those days. Like I liked the oh, days I'm, of watching I'm like, I'm Michael McIntyre, Paprika, being... and then I'm salt and pepper, and then I'm five spice. Come on. <laughs> um, oh, well, but, it was so yeah. At the I time. mean, Glastonbury is my dream festival performer. I did want to is say it? that I wouldn't go until I perform there. Oh. But I do really want to go this year. Oh, I see. Because Taylor what you Swift mean. is rumored, and I am a massive Swifty. Stop I'm it. I'm actually not. I'm not. I'm a very average. You're an average. I'm, I'm Swiftie. an average Swifty. I wouldn't okay. even say I'm a Swifty. I think she's cool. Yeah, I think she's cool, but I don't think she's. Yeah. In fact, I don't think she's cool, actually. That's oh. probably the one thing she isn't. Oh. She's definitely not cool. Isn't she? She's amazing. She's amazingly talented, but she's definitely not cool. Okay. Oh, whatever you she's say. Sort of like what makes you cool these the, days? The perfect like girl next door who's done so well. Is she? I think so. She's quite like, you know. Yeah, she's quite wholesome looking. Yeah. I think. Mm, wholesome looking. Mm. Is that, well, I don't know. Can you? Well, not like somebody like just, Shakira, who's a bit more. What? What am I going to say now? Okay, I'm not going <laughs> to say anything about Shakira. Shakira's not wholesome looking. What's Shakira? No, Shakira's not wholesome looking. Is she Quite wholesome. She's truthful. Hips well, she lie. might be. <laughs> <laughs> He's good, isn't he? Shakira, He's Shakira. All... Shakira, Shakira. What did it when you talk like that? Yeah. Anyway, anyway. moving on. Uh, what were we talking about? Oh, yeah. So, no. Okay. So, Leeds and Reading, or Reading, Reading and, Leeds. and Leeds. Oh, it goes that way around, does it? Yes. Although, actually, 
No. Oh. I've got Friday night I'm doing Leeds. Right. Sunday, Reading. I'm so, bloody excited. I have to say. Yeah, it's very exciting. Well, do I get to come? I don't know. I'm not sure oh. we want to. Well, I will if I, I get because I set is, helicopters the set in. Won't be that long. Yeah, that's oh. going to happen. Oh, won't it? I have to and deal with traipsing and, through the mud. Yeah, and... there'll be a lot of waiting around. I think. Mm, nah, I'll give no, it a miss yeah, then. But I'll send you pictures. Thanks. Mm. I do love the fact that I only find these things out because you put them on Instagram you or something. I have witnesses. You were there when I found out. Oh, you were that, the first no, this fucking person one. I told. Yeah, all right. No, only, but only. But no, okay. No, fair enough. But I didn't know for sure. You had a phone call to say it might be happening when I was there. No, I didn't. Yes, no, I did. I, yes, no, you I did. didn't. Yes, you no, did. No, I didn't. Oh, we're having no. another argument about the yawn, etc. You definitely yawned. Let me no, just say, no, but I, Jack, Jack no. is te- Jack was there. And yes, as Jack soon as was the there finished, and called. Yes, and you said, "I think I'm, I'm. Ne- it's almost definite that I'm going to be doing blah and blah, L and R, R and L, whichever way around it goes, <laughs> L and R rail, and L and R, L and R. That's the one." Um, and we all went, oh, whoopee, lovely. And, and I said, I did let try. me know when it's definite. And I called. And the next thing I, called, I know I called is it's my... on there on Instagram. And I called my dad. And it would be a oh, family call. called your dad. Twice the night before it got announced and he didn't pick up. And then he texted me the next day. Well, you didn't ring me. Because I thought I'd already you told never you. You me. It's putting it out there. <sighs> anyway, that's fine. It's all but fine. anyway, yeah, I'm really happy to be doing it. <laughs> And you can come if you want. Thank you. Yes. Um, mm. August bank holiday. Oh, could you imagine the traffic? And- oh. It's mummy's boy. Do you, have we spoken of Ix before? Ix. I feel like we did, I can't we've, there's no way we've made it this far and not have spoken about Ix. Uh, give me a clue. Um, it, it won't, what context is an He ick? picked his nose and it was a massive ick. Oh, okay. Oh, yes. All right. That yeah. does ring a bell. Yeah. Yeah. Something is a bit icky. Icky. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Something's a bit ick. Ick. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's an ick, isn't yeah. it? Right. I actually. Well, a bit like definitely... taking your shoes off on train. That's an ick. Yes. Massive yeah. Massive ick. ick. Okay. Yeah. Um, I actually recently, ch- this will, yes, it will be out by now. But I, I made my hinge profile into the ickiest hinge oh, profile dear. imaginable. Did you? Yeah. How did you do that? I took a lot of pictures of me um, missing the bus hey. and running for the bus, basically. Why? Because it's icky, apparently. How can you take a picture of yourself running for well, a bus? Okay, I didn't. Someone else someone took else a picture took of it, you I running the, for a bus. Then I missed the train. Right. Which is also an ick. And then... Um, I wore a Nike tech fleece. It's apparently very icky. I asked people in public what this was. Did you? It was like a sort of tracky, combo tracky thing. Right. Um, and then I wore spray on jeans. Oh no, they um, are horrible. Yeah, they're horrible. I'll get I'll get the worst picture up. Oh, I'd like to see spray it. Spray on jeans with um a turtleneck. <laughs> All very tight. Oh no, I'm not going to like it's that. It's horrible. I look like, um, <laughs> I can't think of it, but my body doesn't look. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my <laughs> gosh, you look like something out of Star Trek. <laughs> oh, Arthur, yeah. you literally look like Uhuru from Star Trek. That's my vulnerable <laughs> side, I said. <laughs> and my prompts. Oh my God, that's brilliant. A life goal of mine, having the longest fingernails you've ever seen. Oh, gross. I hate long fingernails. Dating me is like dating Andrew Tate with hair. Oh, Arthur. Um, and that was me. And that's my other side. My it's hoodie. Really not very shoes. nice either. Yeah, a fuck boy. What's a fuck boy? What, do you say what's a fuck boy? I absolutely um, do. A fuck boy is someone who messes around with girls, leads them on. And oh, then okay. Tosses them after being tossed. Very amusing. Or right. More. Yes. Um, oh, yeah. Okay. Just a bit of a player. Okay. So I, yeah. Not me. No. No. Good boy. Fuck boy is the opposite of a gentleman. Yes, indeed. Been raised right by his mother. Yes. Um, but X. There's basically. Okay. 
and you know, I do in a sense feel passionately about this because it feels like men can't exist anymore, you know? <laughs> What do you mean? Oh, God. Without it's being an ick. Again, everything, everything is an ick. Um, and it's become a thing on TikTok. But, so there's a guy on TikTok because he's called the guy with the list. The guy with the list. The guy with the list. Right. And he's made a list of all the icks that he's heard girls okay. say. Right. Um, and so, he literally can't do anything probably. Yeah, basically. So guys here we go. Guys who are like too good at sex kind of gives me an ick. <laughs> and then look, look at the list. You need to go out more. Oh, for heaven's sake. I know. But let's pause it and look to... at the. So it's, this is number 630. <laughs> Don't be too good at sex. Don't mm. swim. Don't go bowling. Don't have what you want tattooed. Don't have a certain name. Don't have earlobes. Don't go to urgent care. <laughs> Don't tie your shoes. Don't have a certain hairstyle. You know? Oh, d- what well, can we do? Well, we have to stand it, still. Arthur. No, you ignore it and go back. These are my icks for men. And my first one, I cannot fucking stand. If I see this, I'm running a mile away. Self- By the way, well, she's but, irritating uh, yeah, like, to start uh, off yeah. with, isn't she? she these can... are my ex for men. <laughs> if I see one of these, I want it a mile away. Please on any form of social media or like dating app. I would rather have you zoom the hell in on your face in a group photo than see a selfie on there. What, who are you doing that for? Like, I but don't know. Oh, God. Can I have a selfie? I mean, I get that, actually. Selfies oh, did you ever do that? No. Also, <sighs> if you have your ears pierced, especially... I'm not doing well if you here. Have, like, a dangle piercing. Oh, no. Cross. No. Pardon. Lastly, if you drive a car. And I know this one seems a bit aggressive, but like, I like a guy who can drive a truck or who's picking me up in a truck. Like, don't be showing up in your fucking hot electric C zero. Oh, she needs yeah, to. Yeah, baby. Get, no, she she's fucking deeply irritating and needs okay, to just sorry. go away. Saw... Oh, go away! Oh, Turn it off. Then he adds she... it on. Let's do another random pause. Oh, don't ever get slightly annoyed. <laughs> don't be in the army. Don't have fun in the snow. <laughs> <laughs> what can you do? Number 492, don't talk. Oh, well, that's that then. Okay. You don't have to speak. Move it to something else. You show me. There is nothing more icky than watching a guy walk out of Starbucks with a frappuccino in his hand, like... <laughs> oh, there is nothing more irritating than your voice. Straw. Oh, my gosh. Order oh, my God. She's so Americano, annoying. Like a man. Oh, turn her off. No, I can't bear it. Right. No. You can now I'm speak, can speak again. Fuck them. I'll speak. Fuck the lot of them. I'll speak as much as I fucking want, ladies. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's just silly. It'll fly yeah. by night, won't it? It's, it's just here. Heck, and... No, it's getting bigger. It's, it's Why? Get, it's a big thing. And well, so what I'm interested in, if I may, is if that was turned the other way round mm-hmm. and you boys did well, it for women, my God, there'd be uproar, I really don't wouldn't really there? Have it would like all be. And a weird ick, you know. No, no, <laughs> I don't mean, no, but I, uh, women would be up in arms saying, you can't say this about us. This is. No, but I think guys don't have them, you know. Oh, I see. Oh, I bet they do. No, I mean, like I, gen- I genuinely really try. There's obviously things I'm not attracted to, but it's the, it's not. There's not like specific things. Like I, I don't like a girl in cargo pants. Don't you? No, that gives me the ick. They wear cargos. But you're not saying cuffed. to people, don't wear them. That's the difference. Mm. You're just saying if yeah. you wear them, I'm not interested mm. in you. That's yeah, not. But the same. as a woman, surely you have some. I have got a bit of a problem with Martin at the moment. Oh, yeah. I shouldn't say. Friends. You know, when you finish your tea. Yeah. And you're going to have another one. And you oh, fling right, the yeah. old tea down the, in the sink. And then you go and make a new one. He never swirls it round. <laughs> it's really irritating. Because it means that there's always bits of tea. old splashy tea things. Mm. Oh, it really upsets me. I was going to have That's to tell him. Ick. I think now he might hear it. Ick. I don't think it's an ick. No. It's a, but it's jolly annoying. What about the old... Um, but you think, well, if that's the only thing... Oh, no, but that's just adorable. He shakes his hands when he gets a bit excited. <laughs> he gets a bit excited or he's looking forward to something. Like when he walks down towards the or sea. Or gets nervous. Or you he know, gets nervous and he'll be walking along and he'll go... <laughs> 
Well, like, if it's an tight it's really England really... game, rugby, he strikes his hands. <laughs> Bless him. He's so lovely. Mm. So There's he's, not he's... many things wrong with Martin. No. But flinging the tea in the sink is That's becoming a little bit of a thing. Almost unspeakable how bad that it's is. Unspeakable. Yeah. So, you know... Right, Mum, I've got a very special game for us to play and you're going to need your eyes. Oh, do, do I need my glasses? So dust off your specs, <laughs> you blind bat. <laughs> blind old bat, yep, yeah, fair enough. It's time for a classic a game. Yes. Of... What are they famous for? Oh, that famous game. What are they famous for? The cover of What Was I Made For? I don't know that one Irish. either. Oh, okay. No. I'm going to show you a celebrity from the world of TikTok and YouTube. Oh, no. And all you've got to do is correctly guess what they are famous for. Oh, God. If you fail, you have to down your tea. <laughs> oh, no, I don't like cold tea. Well, you better not I'll fail have a then. gin or something. It's oh. not very fair, is it? Why do I get tea? Yeah, if you, you'd rather do a shot of gin than down a cold tea. I really couldn't drink cold tea. Really, I'd rather do a shot of gin. But I don't know whether I could do a shot of gin in the afternoon either. Well, just don't something? lose is the answer. Okay, just don't lose. I won't lose. Okay. Yep. Are you ready? First yes. celebrity of the picture game. <laughs> Charlie D'Amelio. Yes, good pronunciation. Thank you. Pretty girl. Charlie D'Amelio. What yeah. is Charlie famous for? A. Oh. Posting videos of her dancing. Yeah. B, posting videos of her doing skateboard tricks. Oh. C, posting videos of her feet oh. on OnlyFans. Oh. I, oh. Charlie, lovely Charlie. Lovely Charlie. I think she posts thingies of her dancing. Correct. Oh, yes. You don't have to down the I'm tea. I'm so glad. Charlie Danilo she... is an American social media personality. Is she? She was a competitive dancer for over 10 years oh. before she started posting dance videos on TikTok in 2019. She now has over 150 million followers. <clears throat> Bloody okay. bonkers. Bloody bonkers. I, I got I that right. I seen her in a long time. I hope she's okay. Oh, well, shout out to Charlie D'Amelio. Shout out Charlie. I know you listen. She could come um, your on dances. the pod were great back in the day. Back in the day. Number two. Carby Lame. Is that right? That is right, yeah. Carby I actually thought Lame. it was Carby Lame, but it's it's Carby Lame. Carby Lame. That's a very funny name. That sounds like a drag artist's name. Carby Lame. I'm sure he'll love that. Straight from um, Las Vegas. What is he most famous for? Hmm. A, the most followed TikTok star on the planet. B, an Italian movie star. C, Adam from my secondary school. <laughs> uh, oh, my giddy aunt. Carby Lame. It's a brilliant name. I'm going to go with, <laughs> with Italian film star. <laughs> it is, in fact, A. Stop it. He is the most followed TikTok star on the planet. He is Senghalese-born Italian social media personality. He is known for his TikTok videos in which he silently mocks overcomplicated life hack videos. As of 2024, he is the most followed user on TikTok with over 161 million followers. Just for doing that, basically. He, uh, he looks thoroughly sort of unassuming. Uh, yeah, he just... Does he do does a lot that. of shrugging? But that's why it works. It's multilingual. Doesn't the speak. Shrug. He like never speaks. He just goes. He never speaks. No, he just goes. Are you serious? Yeah, he just goes. God, we're making life ever so difficult for ourselves. We could just sit here. But he does. He nails it. Does he? Yeah, he does. Pretty. He's special. got a cute face. Yeah. Well, I was sort of. He's got. So he was half Italian. So I. Did, I wasn't. I thought he was French. Off. Well, you were wrong. I was. Right. Number three. Gosh. Who is this? Ooh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Hello. Oh, God. No, no, but I mean, you know. A, oh, who yeah. is this? <laughs> A, <laughs> up here. Drifting off. <laughs> KSI. Oh. B, oh. Lewis Capaldi. 
<laughs> not him. C, Mr. Beast. Oh. 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 Uh. What do you think? Oh, that's... Could this be KSI? Could that be KSI? Knowledge, Damn. strength and integrity. I was going to look image. him up and I forgot. Or is it Mr. Beast? Mr. Beast. I'm trying to remember what you said about Mr. Beast. I can't remember. Um, oh, I, oh, I'm going to go KSI. Correct. Oh, that is KSI. Yes. yes. Oh, I'm very impressed with myself. Last uh, one. Yes. Who is this? He looks young and fresh faced. <laughs> I don't know. You don't know? Should I know? Yes. Oh. I think you've met him. Have I? He hasn't been a guest on the pod, has he? I'm not that close to him. No. Okay, so I haven't. But you think I've met him? You have met him. I have met you him. You have met him. I'll give you a clue. He was at my gig. Which gig? October gig. Apollo? No. No. That was in November. Oh, okay. Headline. Um, oh, he looks very nice and I feel really bad that I can't mm. remember who he is. He's a friend of yours. He is? Yes. He's a friend of yours who is probably a famous TikToker. Because that's the point no. of this game. No, he's not. He's, he's not. He's a famous. He's a famous poet. Singer. Yes. What? Poet. Poet. Yeah. Is he? Yeah. Is he? Yeah. Oh. And he's here right now. <laughs> Chris MD, my housemate. Oh, I've never met him. You have. Have I? At the at the gig, you have. Chris MD. Chris MD. But what the question the is, what does MD stand for? What does it stand for? Oh. Is it A, oh, fuck. Minecraft Dude? Oh. B, Massive Dong? <laughs> or C, Michael Dixon? Um, stop yawning, Arthur. That was not a yawn. I was trying to not Bloody laugh. Bloody was. It should be musical director in my head. Soz. Uh... I thought you lived with a bloke called Chris Kirkham. Clark Kirk? George Clarky. George Clarky, yes. No, I know him. <laughs> I know him. I'm beginning to wonder whether I've gone demented. <laughs> Just <laughs> Dementiaed. Or demented. Don't you live with Chris Kirkham? Kirkham. Who the fuck is... I, I, I know a guy called Cam Kirkham, but... Cam you, Kirkham? But I've never mentioned him That's who him I before. thought you lived with. I, I I don't know how you would know him and not Chris. Oh God! I, I like feel really made a couple bad videos now. of Cam. He's okay. Well, I that's I who I've had in my you, head. Though. I never that would you have lived mentioned with. him to you. I don't think. You see, if I went to his house more often, I'd know who he lived with, wouldn't I? <sighs> God, this is terrible. Well, he looks like a lovely chap. Yeah, he and is I lovely. I think it stands for massive dong. No, I'm joking. The first one, whatever. Minecraft dude. Minecraft dude. Stop yawning. I won't have it. It's Michael Dixon. Oh, it's just his Pete's second sake. name, Chris what, Michael, Michael Dixon. Dixon. Well, that's not his second name. It's his Middle second and, and third second. name. Middle and second. God. Gee, wizard Rooney. And he, don't, he is young there. He, he looks. He looks about He's got a fourteen. Beard now. You think? Yeah. Bless he looked him. about fourteen until a year ago. Well. Well. Oh so dear. you got two wrong I out did. of five, so which I, unfortunately means. <sighs> You have to do the tea no. and the gin. No, I'm not wrong. doing either because I'm old. And Come on, mum. Think of the content. Content, content, content. We like to drink. How much no, is left? I'm Can I see? Can I see how that. much is left? bloody loads in there. I'm not drinking that. <laughs> I'm not drinking that. Do two, fi do two fingers of it. Well, how will you tell? You can sort of sense it. I can tell. Go on. Three gulps, basically. Oh, it's not Three fair. gulps. I don't like it. We like to drink with Lisa because Lisa is our mate, oh, and when she it's, uh, she downs it all in eight, seven, six. Oh, oh <laughs> God! I'm sorry. It's disgusting. <laughs> it oh. can't be that bad. There's no way That's it really just being disgusting. cold. I hate cold tea. You're really horrible to God, me. Oh, straight, <laughs> straight back out. God. I'm terribly sorry. I'd rather have had the gin. 
Oh, you! <laughs> wow, that was pathetic. That was pathetic. That was a pathetic well, because I wasn't attempt. expecting you to sing. I didn't know there was an accompaniment. You never heard that before. No, God, I thought I you didn't have much fun when you were younger. I didn't do things like that when I yeah, was younger. To live a little. Maybe we should take you to I a did festival. Live. I lived a lot. Sure, you did. I did actually. Mm. Well, no, I understand. You know, I the think Second one World day War took all your golden years away a... from you. What took my golden years? <laughs> What did, what did I miss that? What took my golden years? The Second World War. So, <laughs> <laughs> yes, all that time mm. I spent. Yes. yes. Anyway, um, I think one week, I shall have a word with Jack. Um, I should do a thing, uh, Two oh, Lies like and a, a Truth, about some things what I've done for you to tell right. me what's uh, true. And you could do people that you think, you know, who you are famous for you that I wouldn't know. All yes. The, all the people you mentioned. Like I, you know, Harry Seacom. Yeah, of course. Yeah. I wouldn't know any of them. No, exactly. Can, I can guess what they're famous for. Right. Good idea. Plan. Um, but before we go into a break, Mum, let's go back to usual service, usual programming. Usual service has and resumed. Play an even classicer game. Of even more classic. Two lies even. and a truth. Yes, go on. Then. I'm going to tell you three things. Oh. And you have to guess which is the truth. And I'll give you the answer in part two. Are you ready? Not in the slightest. In the past few months, a thermos cup made by the brand Stanley has gone viral after a video surfaced showing one being pulled out of the wreckage of a car fire and the contents of said tumbler still containing ice. Oh. But what is the name of this new must-have drinking receptacle? Is it A, Madame Frosty? B, the quencher H2O, dot O, H2.0, mm. or the IIC 3000? IIC? IIC. IIC, as in? I, the IIC, as in IC, 3000. <sighs> Join us in part two, where we'll find out the answer. <laughs> and for mum, can we talk? Correspondence. Mummy. I think mummy needs needs <laughs> something. Needs a Stanley cup. It's mummy's boy. Welcome back. Thank you very, very much. No problem. Sorry. Very shortly we'll be getting to your mum can we talk correspondence. But first, before the break, I asked you this question. Yes. In the past few months, a thermos cup made by the brand Stanley has gone viral after a video surface showing one being pulled out of the wreckage of a car fire and the contents of said tumbler still containing ice. But what is the name of this new must-have drinking receptacle? Is it A, Madame Frosty, B, the Quencher H2.0, the IIC 3000? Okay. I don't think it's Madame Frosty because that just sounds like something childish. Mm. From Frosty the Snowman or something. The second one sounds quite um, feasible. Quencher. The Quencher sounds feasible. But I rather like the idea of the third one, which sounds a bit like a Harry Potter uh, broomstick with the point the, three thousand. That's 000. the IIC 3000. Yes, exactly. Yeah. I quite like that. Mm. And so, with no further ado, I'm going for C. I see, I see, thing, 3,000. Mum, you put the L in Lisa. The answer is B. <laughs> the quencher. Oh. H2.0. Oh, bugger, that's boring. One viral TikTok showed the oh. charred remains of a car fire with only the Stanley quencher H2.0 left intact. Wow. There was even ice inside the cup. Wow. I know. Savvy Stanley crazy. CEO Terence Riley responded to the video with a Mr. Beast-esque act of generosity. Mr. Beast. Offering the TikToker a brand new oh. car. Oh. Blimey, it's all connected, isn't it? However. Oh, God, there's more. Stanley fans are now concerned that their limited edition collectibles might be leaking lead. Oh. After another viral video posted oh. on TikTok showing a parent using an at-home lead test at the bottom of her child's Stanley bottle, and the test was positive. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Lots of drama around the Stanley Cup. There is, isn't there? Mm. Who were? Terence better sort it out. Mm. They are investigating it. Are they? But they've got no leads at the moment. Mm, no. 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 
that was um, sort of I still yeah I sort of I've only seen this from afar really I don't know too much about it See, I wasn't aware that's cool. how it started I have to say Gosh. um mm. if only the hundreds of people that had died in the fire had been in the Stanley Cup and did lots uh, of no, people I don't know do? I, no, I hope okay. not I assume well, no, not I hope not too um Cut. Cut. Um, <laughs> and I've never, I don't know what they look like. I was sort of, yeah, I don't really, I, don't, I didn't get the fuss, to be honest. No. I, haven't, I well, used to be, I, I lost my chili bottle. I was quite attached to my chili bottle. And oh, I lost, did you? I lost that. Oh, God, um, you're always losing yeah, things. Yeah, I lose things. You lost your key ring yet? No. Ah, oh, excellent. Mm. Hurrah. That remains. Good. Um, but Stanley, if you're watching, I'll take your lead-filled cup. I won't. No? No. Have you got you have got your own bottle? Charlotte likes her own bottle. I haven't. Bottles, Charlotte does, uh, but no. I've I'm got a big one. I'm trying to drink drinking. more water. I've got to do that. Mm. That's a bit. Three liters a, big... a day. I'm trying to do, but oh blimey! I'm lucky if yeah. I get one glass. I think I might be chronically really? dehydrated. You don't have. I never drink water. That's really bad. Yeah, I know. You should drink. I know. It could it could explain an awful lot. Yeah, you really should. <laughs> At my brain. It's the sustenance my ability of life. To... Yes. And we are the bastions. Indeed, we are. Of this earth. Yes. And water is our fuel. Indeed. Um, <laughs> We're so wise. It's mummy's boy. Are you ready for some mum can we talk correspondence? <laughs> Stop being silly. Shall we dive in? Oh, yes. In the deep end Get the of mum can we talk? Move on. Correspondence. Oh. From Charlie, question one. Hi, Mrs. Hill. Hi. With you being no stranger to the West End stage, oh. which show or character would you cast Arthur in? Oh! Personally, I can see him as Charlie Price from Kinky Boots. Oh, okay. I don't know Oh, that. yeah. I hope that's not... Oh, what... yeah, that would be great. Good casting mm -hmm. idea, Charlie, actually. Um, well, I, funnily enough, earlier we were discussing... Dear Evan Hansen. Thank you. Dear mm. Evan Hansen. And uh, I think Arthur would be quite good in mm. that. But I also, I'd like to, I, All Book of Mormon. I see his sky for forever. This would be my audition. Can I do it now? Let the world to... pass by. No, because you're taking for the mickey. forever. Feels like we could go on. <laughs> I hate. I can't do it. I can't no. do it. Um, but you could do a bit of Mormon, couldn't you? I would love. I would love to do book of Mormon. Give us a bit I think of Mormon. That's probably my dream role. Come on, come on. Give no, us a I, bit of Mormon. Oh, come on! You're always doing know. it. You do it walking down the street. You do a bit of ding dong. What? Hello, my name is Elder, Elder Price. Price. I don't remember that to be honest. Don't you? Gone or shy? Oh, how irritating! Um, I believe oh! <laughs> the God created the universe. Yes. Good, good stuff. It is great stuff. So yeah, um, I'd like to. Yes, I would Mormon. always say actually that if you're trying to get someone into musicals who doesn't like musicals, that's what you should take them to. More uh, Mormon. Book of Mormon. Yeah, good idea. Because it's not. It's very, very yeah, funny. It is very funny. Um, any other suggestions that uh, you can see me in? Any other John suggestions? John Valjean. Definitely not. No. No, nothing in Les Mis. Really? Yes. Red. Oh, stop it. The blood of angry men. <laughs> Black. Here comes Michael Ball. My world when she's not there. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, lovely. Oh, dear. Um, we should get Michael Ball on, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure Michael so would good. love it. You can it. hash out all your problems. Yeah, I'm sure Michael would mm. be very happy to I do got that. Beef. We've not got beef. Beef with bull. We haven't got beef. You have, you have got a bit we of beef. We have not no, you've got, got no beef. beef. But you've told a few funny stories about I have him. told a few funny stories, stories about him. But we won't because he might hear. It's um, unlikely. No. Um, um, uh, the other thing you could do would be um, The Lion King. You could play... Um, is that not strictly Oh, well, I'm just being very woke. No, not woke. The opposite and of that. I don't know what I'm being. No, yes, no, there is. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> the one who does Hakuna Matata. Which one's that? Not Pumba, the other one. The little skinny the, the, one. The... Timon. Couldn't you play could, Timon? And, and then Dad could be the warthog. With his Dad warthog could do impression. his warthog. That would be amazing. When I was a young warthog. And then Dad yes, can go, I love go, Yes, just like that, Arthur. Yeah. Um, we've got another voice note. <laughs> As for question two. Have we? We sure do. Excellent. Right. From Mia. Mia. Mm. 
Me, I hope it's not embarrassing. <laughs> okay. Hi, Lisa and Arthur. Um, I used to date a guy that got his penis out in public when he was really drunk or if he was just dared to. Um, so that's my story. Oh, um, Mia! Also, uh, I've seen a video of him in a Spider-Man stance, shitting mid-air into a toilet. So that's my, um, that's, that's my past. Um, what? anyway, uh, as for my Shit. question, if there's oh. anyone you would potentially... What's your top three movies? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, top three packet of crisps. Um, oh, sorry. Anyway, uh, uh, as for my question, hmm. if there's anyone you would potentially set me up on a date with, uh, like a blind date or something... Who who would it be, and could you possibly make it happen? Because no, because you're mad. I've had in my life are absolutely disgusting. I mean, anyway, the ones in, that live where I live. Well, there's, there's more. I don't really know what she what she wants. <laughs> also, as a little side note, um, Arthur, you seem to be following one of my good friends. Um, just thought I'd add that one there because. You know, small world. Yeah. Oh. Um, I apologise in advance for everything that you just listened to. <laughs> right. My life Thank you, Mia. is very weird right now. Mia. Mia, you've described your boy, your old boyfriends <sighs> and then just been like, can you set me up with someone? We don't know anything about you. We just know that you've gone for a man who got his penis out in public. <sighs> And sh I can't, I tried to Can we envision. not talk about the, in, in, uh, yeah. can we not? Shat, it's, yeah, he's can in, we he's not? He's mid-air in a Spider-Man costume, or is it his position, stance? Stance. Spider-Man stance. Yes. Shitting mid-air. Yeah, can we not? Mia, oh. can we not? How many I'm, times do I have to say, can to we the, not on this new, podcast before you stop ringing in mm, about it? The new Avengers sounds a bit shit. God, I, I mean, yeah. I mean, Mia, we can. We, I don't. We don't know enough about you to set you up. Just, um, you know, I don't know. Just pick better. Give pick me. better. Um, yes. But you know, thanks for sending in. I, 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 I don't really I'd love know, to know why where she you did. Live and you know where you get these guys from. Um, yeah, she sort of sounds like what, she's what living she in the middle of nowhere. What does she mean by Spider-Man stance? I don't know. Like when he sort of like got his legs out of like that and he's well, like that. I think so. And he's just shitting. Instead of shooting webs, he's shitting webs. That's <sighs> pretty crazy. Oh, God. I would love to know the context as to why he's done that as well. Would you, though? Yeah, I think I would. You see, I think I've been quite nice on these questions mm. in the past because at the end of the day, nobody will, I don't want people to hate me. No. But I did, li I was listening to the, funnily enough, I was listening to the music at the beginning of the podcast. And I noticed your lyrics actually do say, watch my mother, what is it, my mother getting annoyed. So I've decided I am now annoyed. And can you stop sending fucking stupid messages <laughs> about shitting? Because it's boring and silly. There. And I don't care if you don't like me anymore. I've said Sorry, it. Mia. But none of that came from me. Thank you for being no, a fan. No, it all came from me. But Arthur doesn't mind talking about yeah. shit, but I do. Yeah. So there we are. Mia. Careful, Mia. Sort yourself out, you see love. mum in the street. Yeah. I'm... Apologise. Yes. You've upset my sensibilities. Mm. I do but have thanks some. thanks for watching or listening. Yes. Continue to do that. But you don't have to listen to me. YouTube now. <laughs> um, <laughs> right. Have we got another question? We do have another question. Shit. From Demi. 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 Come on, Demi. Hi, uh, Mr. and Mrs. Hill. Oh. Well, mm. Dad's so not here. Mean... Yeah. Well, but, we'll, well see. she must mean us. She must. Unless you've got a podcast with Dad, I don't know about. No, I haven't. Please help. Oh. My ex. Oh no. We'll call him Nigel. Shall we? Treated me really badly. Oh. oh. Um, he was always so emotionally unavailable. I could literally cry right in front of him, and he would continue with whatever he was doing and not even bat an eye. Twat. L Sorry. <laughs> Long story short, I dumped him because he was a dick. Yes. But now he's got a new girl. Should I tell her about the way he treated me or just no, leave it? leave it. Yeah. 
Leave it. Leave He's it. gone. He wasn't worth it. He was a waste of space and you're worth much better. Get on with your life. What was her name? Demi. Demi. Get on with your life, Demi. Meet a nice young man. Yes. Who is emotionally available to mm. you and will cuddle you when you cry. Yes. 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 Yeah, it, yeah it's not your duty to... No, it's not. She'll find know, maybe out Maybe he learned enough. from you, you know. Maybe. And maybe he'll be better to her and that's... And that's fine. That's fine. But there's just better things coming for exactly. you, Demi. Yes, Demi. Dem... Dem... Yeah. Don't try and find something funny to say about Demi. Yeah, no. No, it's, it's not fine. coming, yeah. is it? Just leave it. the cogs were Just engineer. leave it. But yeah, Nigel, fuck off, Nigel. Yeah, fuck, fuck off, off Nigel. Nigel. How about you cuddle someone when they're crying, Nigel? Yeah. Demi. Come on. Demi it. De no. No. Shit. No. Um, okay. Thanks, Demi. Moving, moving on to yes. question four. The final question. Yep. From Celine. Celine. Mm. What have you done today to make you feel proud? <laughs> Who was that? Is that Celine Dion? No. Shit. Uh, you burk. Damn it. What have you done today to is make not you Celine feel Dion? proud? No. Who is that? Celine Dion is, um, you know, my mm. heart will go on. Oh, yeah. There were nights when the wind was so cold. That was a TikTok trend. <laughs> Cause there were nights of endless pleasure. Were there? Were da, 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 da. Baby, 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 when you touch, touch me, me like that and you hold me like that. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway. Um, <laughs> Hi, Arthur and Lisa. Hi. I constantly get people singing Celine Dion when I. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, Celine. No, when I was about 10 years old, <laughs> oh God, I oh watched no. a top 10 celebrity tattoos video and saw Mia Khalifa, who I'm sure you know, made the list with her tattoo showing a quote of the Lebanese national anthem. Oh. I myself am Lebanese. And so I got really excited and I went ahead and told my mum that I want a tattoo just like Mia Khalifa. My oh. poor mum had to sit me down and explain who Mia Khalifa was. Anyway, my question is, have you ever got a tattoo you regretted? And does Lisa know who Mia Khalifa is? Ah, oh, excellent. I'm glad you put that bit on the end, darling, mm. Celine, because no, I've got a flipping clue. Who is mm. she? Um, Mia Khalifa. Mia Khalifa. No. Is a porn, porn, star. porn star. What a surprise. Ex-porn star. Oh, okay. Um, well, is she now the president of the UN or something? Um... No, she's not. She's, she's not. not. Um, okay. I don't know what she does now. I think she, I see. I see her occasionally on the internet. Do you? Yeah, oh, yeah. I see. fully what clothed in the pub. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm. Why would your mum know? Ah, oh, there's a question. Is? Yeah, have I got a tattoo I regretted? Yes, I have. Have uh, you? Yeah, I think I regret a couple of them. Not like to oh. a massive extent, but which um, ones? Do well, you this regret? one, I sort of. Oh, the one I don't regret the wonky. context of it. It's a. It's an on button on my wrist. Hmm. That I got in Canada. We talked about um, that once. Yeah, we have talked about this. But um, yeah. yeah, it's just but a bit yeah, wonk. It's, it's a bit wonky. It's on the wonk. Um, and then I've got Life's a Dance, which I got forced into getting. Did you? With my tattoo artist. Let me see. Because I, I originally I just... wanted Life's a Dance. And then I thought that's the cringiest thing ever. And then oh. she was laughing that I ever thought about it. So then we got it matching. Um, oh, crikey. Yeah. And then this one as well. And then that one. And I hate all of them. I'm going to get them all removed. Oh, stop it now. You can't get no, them removed, I, And the one on my you? belly, I sort of look at sometimes and think I think, what the fuck? Weird. That's going to be on me forever. It is... Um, what is it's it? A, it's a fat child in a pushchair. Really old enough is. to run. Old enough to fire a gun. Is that what it's... Yeah, it's a, it's a drawing of a lyric of one of my favourite songs. Everything, Everything, oh. the band. No Reptiles. Anyone know the song? No. Great song, is it? Um, but I thought I'd get. Maybe I felt. I, sometimes I feel like a fat child in a pushchair, old enough to run, old enough to fire a gun. You never look fat. No, but you know. No. I was in a pushchair being pushed, but I, really I wanted to run and fire oh, I guns. See. Did you? Yeah. And now I don't anymore, and I've got this tattoo. I see. 
at the time I got it, I wasn't good at saying like no. Mm. So like the first sketch that my tattoo artist showed me, oh, I was like, oh, like, I love oh, it. Yeah. Oh, and I should have just gone like, idiot. no. Um, but you know, it, I can always sort of replace it with a massive love heart or something. Can um, you replace? Th- how does it? I well, don't I, know. I have to draw over it, which is the annoying thing. I see. Mm. I haven't ever uh, regretted one because I haven't got one. Mm. I have thought about having yeah. one. We've had this conversation. We've had this as well. conversation, but, but you haven't yeah, got it yet. I, I haven't got it yet because I still can't think of what I want. I like the idea of text, though. I like the idea of kind of like yeah. nice text. So live, live, laugh, love. Maybe definitely not that. Or or dance no, like what have, no one's what have watching. We got in our kitchen. Those we've, got one, we've got one medium bad one in our kitchen. Have we? This this home is full of love, laughter, and, and a dog. dog. Yeah. Yeah. And I wouldn't dog have piss. that. Yeah, I wouldn't yeah. have that. No. Tattooed. No. Mummy's boy. No. Twenty twenty four. Then a dash. No. No. Marbella, 2018, on your ass cheek? No. No? I've got that. No, you have not. I do. I've never told you. No, you haven't. I've seen your bottom. Not recently. I not since I've... the bath two weeks ago. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> you know, my... No. 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 You Carry on. You do not bathe me anymore. That doesn't happen anymore. No, I haven't done that for quite a long at least a year ago. Yeah, yeah. Um... We've come to the end. Oh, have we? We have. Oh, dear. Um, thank oh you dear. for everyone sending your questions in. Um, it's absolutely sensational, as always. <laughs> My notes. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, look, paper oh, everywhere. Oh, God. Um, you'd think you'd know it by now, wouldn't you? Yeah, you would, wouldn't you? You would, really. I'm going to I'm gonna have to wing it. Oh, no. Um, right. What's the podcast called again? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You've been listening to Mummy's Boy. Tune in every Wednesday. Yes. Um, for the for the you know we have the full episode on YouTube now. Very exciting. You get to see our faces for forty five minutes straight. Well, hey. Um, in crisp HD. Um, and if you fancy it, um, on on the on the audios things as well. So the um, audio, the audio things. things as well. But of course, if you want to send any questions in. Um, make sure you send it in to at mummy's follow at mummy's boy pod first yes, on Instagram yes. and TikTok and WhatsApp me on <laughs> it didn't do. I know the number. Do you actually know the number? Uh, yes, it's 07822 013 837. There you go. You see? There you go. I didn't lose my bit of paper. Well, you read it off the paper. Yeah, you don't yeah, know it, do you? No, oh, but you've lost your bit of paper. Yeah, and I'm ahead of you on that. Lose my bit. Um, And we'll see you next week. Next week. Diddly pom. Adios, amigos. Indeed, at that. Bye. Bye bye. It's raw. It's mummy's boy.